Good morning. Today I'm going to hike Mount Woodson. I'm gonna do this. I don't know what this lady's doing. Like, what the heck? I'm like parked. I'm going. I'm going now. You gotta put on your seatbelt, you know, to be safety wise. Put the AC, might as well enjoy it. Okay, so this is where some people said to go add two miles to the hike, but I don't have to pay $5. Two extra miles, not too bad. I think I'm willing to do that. Okay, so you start here. And then there should be signs. Well, I guess the speed limit of five miles per hour kind of defeats my thought of uh, taking out my mountain bike. Uh, I'm already lost. Well, I stepped in and I saw no horses. So I don't think I can go this way since the other people were going to take um, around like Poway as well. So I'm gonna go up the non-shaded way. Well, if I don't make it back, I could at least be thankfully, thankfully, you know, picked up by a vulture. So that's good. No littering on the road. Going straight, and then you'll come across this fork. Lake Poway. Here we go. Okay, so I came from that trail. There's this trail behind me, and there's a trail here. I'm gonna take this trail, because it says Mount Woodson. The way that I, the stuff that I pack or take with me when I go hiking, just about the exact way when I go on a long century ride. Every five minutes, three minutes, I only take a sip of water that has a little bit of mix of electrolytes in it, Gatorade. Depending on your body, you know, as you go on these hikes, you'll figure it out. And you don't want to get to the point where you feel thirsty. When you feel thirsty, you're dehydrated. It's too late. You don't want to get to that point. So I guess this is Lake Poway. Can we call it Lake Poway? I thought it was a dam. Yeah, that's definitely behind me, Lake Poway. And so if you weren't going to go to Blue Eco Ecological Reserve, you can go to Lake Poway and that cuts off two miles from your hike. The trailhead starts over there. Here's a map that I saw because obviously it's my first time. I have to keep going around the lake and I guess there's going to be a fork. I need to take the left to Mount Woodson. And you're going to come around and it's going to split into two. There's a sign to show you if you're on the right track. 2.9 miles till we get to the top of Mount Woodson. I guess this is a sure sign that a lot of people come here. I've been seeing a lot of trash cans and so far I've already seen from the Blue Ecological Reserve, I've seen three restrooms. The first one was in the parking lot of Blue Ecological Reserve. There was a porta potty second one was the one I showed you. Picnic rest area and this actually has soap, paper towels, and a sink, but no doors. Just just a headset. From the from the trail I just looked like it was seriously just a pile of rocks stacked up with a roof on top. I and mean, it, it was only like a foot from the ground. But when you walk down around it, it's a building. And then the third one was right in front of Lake Poway, give three chances. Side note, I want to thank my student Andy for taking my eye touch and filling it completely with the best trans dance um, music. So thank you, Andy. Squirrel! Squirrel! Meow! 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 
Okay, so I see this marker and I am going the right way. So usually what that means, it's gonna be a roundabout. Meaning I'll go in this way, and I'm gonna come out this way. Getting to the base of Mount Woodson. Well, this is pretty. Yes, I'm a big flower person. And you're gonna to want to take the left. Well, it's definitely getting steeper. Keeps going up, tight turns, switchbacks, very tight switchbacks, and you're going over boulders and steps. We start, um, yeah, it's a good workout. Near the top, there's this tree. It shades a great amount of area. So if you're hiking to the top, this is a nice spot. You can check out the view. Matt Woodson, 1.3 miles. Uh, at the base, it said 1.9. You're telling me I only went 0.6 miles? That's crazy, because it, it does. It, it continues to um, incline switchbacks, and you're thinking you're at least doing a mile, you know? I'm, I'm talking like you guys are like here. I mean, the, like, yeah. Hey guys, do you know? Do you know? Let's see. There's no way to get past this. I don't know if you can see it. It's huge. I'm just gonna run it. The two girls that I met, I know one name is Angelica, and they're so funny because of the snake. Well, the, the taller one was really, really scared, but Angelica, um, the shorter one, was like, oh, just do it, just do it. Um, I ended up having to push, yeah, I literally like pushed the taller one um, to get across, and she screamed. <laughs> Hope I get to see them again because they made me laugh, and if you make me laugh, it's a good day, right? So I'm almost there. Potato chip rock. That's cool. Matt Woodson Summit. Point two. I don't know if I can make it. Yeah, I got you shimmying up. <laughs> So I just Introduce. met. What's your name? My name is Vicky. Vicky. Okay, I'm Yogi. Oh, oh. you have to do yoga. Then. <laughs> crazy strong. She just like picked me oh, up. Not crazy strong. Like no. Okay, crazy. <laughs> she was. She was pretty strong. <laughs> the um, just a style of yoga that's constantly flowing is vinyasa. Okay, that's what I need to remember. V i n y a s a. Okay. And um, like hatha, gentle, restorative is lots more mellow and chill, which is good too. But vinyasa just usually keeps going. Okay. Do you have Do you have like a place that we could go? Where do you live? Oh, hi, oh, hi. I live. Over and then do you teach or you? Just I do, do teach, it? but you up in teach. North County in Vista. Yeah. Okay. Yoga Vista. I know. Okay. But I'm actually. Um, we're gonna start doing videos on the website that you can do it at home, and that's hearthum.com. Okay, see, I'm gonna record that to go on yeah. YouTube, by oh, the way. Cool. Yeah, yes. H E A R T H U M.com. Okay, yeah. you guys got that. I'm Lucky Yogi. <laughs> Restoring sugar. Another thing that cyclists do is they eat an orange. This is what works for me, and uh, if anyone else has tips out there, what works for them to last on long hikes. You know, let me know. Comment below so everyone else can learn too. So that'd be cool. That'd be something new on the Lucky Yogi channel for the Lucky Yogi family. Encouraging everyone to work out, to get outdoors, get out from the cubicle, get out from their office, and to enjoy the outdoors. Comment below and give me some tips. And for the rest of the Lucky Yogi family, what's the next trail I should do? So I can bike down. 
Man, this is definitely taking a toll on my calves. Uh, I already fell once. I was eating my sandwich and I fell like whoop, right on my butt. My sandwich goes flying out of my hand. I'm pretty hungry, so what do you think I did to that sandwich? What do you think? What do you think? <laughs>